one thing that we can take as an action item, like or something to think on, is who am I surrounded with? Am I surrounded with people who actually prioritize and give thanks to Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, or because sometimes maybe necessary, you want to be surrounded with high people of high aspiration, high ambitions, people who are hustling, working hard. But many of those times, they may be deceived. Uh, in not thanking and not acknowledging Allah, and as as we mentioned, like not having Allah in the equation, then you know that can actually have a negative effect on you, unless you can really stand out. And and we see this, right? I mean, if you talk the example of sports with Khabib and and his crew, they are working hard, but when they win and as they're preparing, they are actually acknowledging and they're not shy to have this identity that I understand that I'm going to work hard, but success is from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And if, if he doesn't want, then I won't have it. So either making your environment easy that you do not surround yourself with the people that are not on the same wavelength or being comfortable in being unique in being, you know, uh, different and in being true to, to, to what you believe in.